Hello. Good day, everybody. I just want to show you, uh, whatever. <laughs> this is a rock I picked up on that old uh, slate pile. You know, I picked it up because it had a little quartz running through it. Well, I hit it with a hammer, and it just shatters. But this is what I got from it. But in a way, it looks like pyrite. In a way, it doesn't look like pyrite, or any pyrite I ever found. So, if anybody knows or got an idea what this is, I would appreciate it. Let me know. Now, the quartz in there does have a few specks of gold, not much, a few little spots here and there. The rest of it, and it is heavy. I'm going to give you, a, for example, this piece right here. That weighs 37 grams. Now, the pyrite I found down there is uh, usually cubes. There's a little different color than this. This kind of looks silvery. Very heavy. I soaked it in a, a rust remover for a few days and it didn't do anything. It still looks. It's kind of a reddish, reddish brown color, but there's the quartz. And there's a couple little spots of gold in there. No, they're not very big, but. I know one thing. It's pretty. It's very, very heavy. Now it may end up to be pyrite, but like I say, I'm kind of. I'm not a hundred percent on it, so could use a little advice. But just occasionally, the Corvettes would get the chance to turn the. I decided I'd just keep it because. People collect specimens of different kind of rocks and stuff, so there's some nice, uh, nice collectible rocks, I guess. But all in all, I have, I'm not sure what it is. Like I say, it doesn't look like any pyrite I've, I've found or have found. It, uh, Way, way heavy, very heavy stuff. God. And it has quartz in it, as you can see. And a few specks of gold in the quartz, so. Any ideas, guys? Just uh, give me your opinion, please. And thank you. And we'll see you all later. Bye. Unlike modern submarines, U-boats were slow in the water.